Welcome to the Neridian Medicare Portal Registration Tutorial. In this video, I will go over Step 2 of Registration and setting up the Multi-Factor Authentication. Additional videos are available for the other steps of the registration process. The information given in this training is correct as of March 2022. The most current information contained in this presentation can be found on the Neridia Medicare website and the CMS website at the links listed on this slide. Step 2 of the registration process is confirming your email address. The email that you received after completing Step 1 will have a confirmation link in it. Once the link is selected, you will be brought to the login page of the portal. You will then enter in your username and password that created in Step 1. The confirmation link must be selected within 48 hours to confirm your account. If you do not confirm the email within 48 hours, you can contact Meridian User Security and they will send out another email. Once your email has been confirmed and you logged in again, you will be prompted to set up the Multi-Factor Authentication, or MFA. MFA is a multi-factor authentication, which is a CMS requirement for all MAC portals. It is an additional layer of security for your portal account. There are three options you can use to receive your MFA code, email, text, or voice call. The additional code is needed every time you log in, so the code is just a one-time use. To begin the MFA setup, the email address you entered on Step 1 will be automatically selected as the default delivery method. Choose the Verify button. An email is then sent to your email address with a passcode. Once you receive that email, enter the passcode in the Verify Passcode box and choose Submit. After that code is successfully entered, the email will display as verified. Now you may have all three MFA delivery methods if you choose to, but only one is required. If you'd like to add text or voice, select the Add button, enter the phone number, and select Verify. The same verification box will display. You'll receive the text or phone call and enter the passcode and come back to this page. Once the options you want to use have been verified, you will choose the Submit button. Then you'll receive a message that your MFA was successfully enrolled. This means that now every time you log into the portal, you will need to enter your username and password and then choose to receive the passcode by one of the delivery methods you had chosen to set up. You can choose Continue to move on in the registration process. You can change your MFA delivery method at any time after your registration is completed. This is the end of the Step 2 tutorial. Please find the additional tutorials for the following steps.